Welcome to OpenOffice Video. In this video we'll show you how to uh, create uh, or how to format a previously created chart and make it even prettier than they're already in by default. We have here the uh, data range and the chart we created in the last video. Let's say we change our mind and we want to create and uh, to make it a column graph and not a bar graph. We select the appropriate part of the of the chart by clicking here, making sure that the green um, rectangles, the green squares, sorry, are around the chart area itself. And then we click the right mouse button, go to chart type, and we select column. We can also use the nice 3D look. Let's say we want to change the color from blue to green. We double click to select the columns itself so that you have the green squares here and we double click here and we say we can select any color we want. Let's just say green. There you have it. Um, what we can also do is uh, change the background of the columns which is called the chart wall. We select it here. Oh, you can do it like this, you can actually change this box, but we don't want that to be this weird. So, but we can here we have the chart wall selected, and we go to right, right mouse button format wall, and we can say fill. And let's just have a color, let's just make that a light gray, or even better, we can select gradient, which is uh, go slightly from one color to the next. But let's just keep a gray gradient, and we'll go up. Slightly this way. Now we can do the same with the uh, chart area itself. So we click here, so we have the chart area selected. Right mouse button, form a chart area, and let's just give that a very well. What do we like today? A very light turquoise one. And we can say transparency because this is a bit um, too sharp for my eyes now. We can just select transparency 60%. That would be very light. We can also insert a gradient here, here you see, but this is mm, start value 20, so it starts a bit like, no, and then we click it on OK, and we have a nice gradient here as well. Also, we can select the values here on the y-axis, and let's just say we want to change this to red. We have a font, so you can say, OK, I want to make this a bit bigger. And you can say font effects, I want the color to be red. And we click OK. Now it becomes bigger and red. Well, this goes on and on. Um, what we can also do is we can say, I want to move this chart a bit. This is very easy. We can just yeah, select here and just move it around. And now it moves here. What we can also do is we can say, I want to copy this chart and I want to insert it into a writer document. Sorry about that. New text document. And I can just say paste. Now obviously that's something wrong since I only selected the back wall. We just delete this. We go to the sales report thing again. And now it's right. Uh, window. And now we say paste. And there it is. And we can type in like, oh, oh wow, this was a great month, etc. etc. All right, that was this video on how to format the charts. I hope you find it useful. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. Bye.